Right now, along with Paladin, Mage is one of the worst classes in the game. So we're gonna do our part today and raise Mage's win rate by 1%. And to do that, all we have to do is win a couple games with Highlander Mage, who I believe is the best kind of mage. Think about it, you got Alexstrasza and Dragon Queen Alexstrasza. Two Alexstrasza's, one deck. That's my kind of situation. Ha, this guy's toast. Ho ho, a paladin? Hello, fellow dumpster player. Begin. Welcome, welcome. Wow, this is a good hand. I can play Arcane Breath and Discover Spell. I can play Zephyrus. I can play Flame Fire Tree Witch Doctor and Discover a Spell. Seems good. I don't have that much dragons, too. So having Malagos Aspect of Magic on early well curve is met. great. What three drops does Zephyrus usually give you if you play it on turn two? I wonder. Paladin who runs crystal. You're scaring me. I see a vision in display. Uh Pyroblast. Spellbender. I think Spellbender is fun against Paladin because they have so much buff cards. Like uh Pharaoh's Blessing and Blessing of King. Blessing this, blessing that. There's a lot of blessing going on. He runs Acolyte of Pain. I can only assume he is um, uh, OTK Paladin. I can make other assumptions as well. Mm, we do want to pile on the pressure if we can then. By the holy light. Mm, yeah, this should give us some pressure. Ooh, Dragon Breath into more Dragon Breath. Yeah, let's... Question. My hand is too full. Oh my well god, played. he burned Shrivala. The victory. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Okay, GG, next. Thank you, next. Mage versus Priest. Let the games begin. All right, he's gonna probably be resurrect priest, right? That's the only priest list running around. Would Zephyrus know to give me polymorph? How smart are you, Zephyrus? You're a smart guy, right? All right, milled one card, milled one card, milled one card. I milled three cards just by having one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen 14, 15, 16, 17 minions. In my deck, and four spells. Oh, God, okay. I don't think it'd be how it'd be, but... It do, man. It really do. Try to ping him to give him one obelisk guy. I mean, can I technically remove all his minions? No, I think that's really hard to do. Ooh, used his. Oh no, 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 no! I need to make sure I get Dragon Valley. Discover a spell that costs three or less. Could be potentially good. Hmm. Free. Oh, Mirror Entity is actually really good in this matchup. Bad Luck Albatross. Against my Highlander deck. That's kind of... That's kind of rude, man. <laughs> oh, God. He actually has a Bad Luck Albatross. Okay. Well, alrighty then. Mm, not much we can do about it. Besides draw the Albatross. Feels bad. But the earlier I kill the albatross, the faster I draw them, so I can activate my Prino and Zephyrus again. Yeah, he's just gonna have a pass turn. Normally, really happy to see the dragon queen there. 
Highlander card, Highlander card, Highlander card. I drew all three Highlander cards against an Albatross Priest. Ah, what an interesting. Oh, there we go. Good luck, do come true. But he doesn't have to know I have my Albatross, right? I should have played this for draw. Sorry, I drew the Albatross already. Now, oh, there's no huge point for me to use this, right? Besides to save this to health, which doesn't seem worth it. Some kind of taunt, rezzing priest. But I am intrigued. This game is definitely go not going to fatigue. I need him to use all his stuff. Of We're gonna have some fun. Mm. I think that's the best bit. Keeps Luna, makes it less resistant, more resistant to like Breath of the Infinite. Like he can kill it, but I still keep everything else. Let's resurrect. Oh god, Albatross again. Please, sir. Enough with the Albatross. Life and I can play this now before more Albatross comes in. Set each player's mana crystal to 10. Oh, that's already done, sir. In time, Behold the tools of creation. Squawk, squawk! Return to nothing. Uh, Arcane Breath for value. I'll save this. Actually, no, I have to play it. I need to pressure him to use his removal. Use one mass resurrection already. I mean, these albatrosses are helping me in the fatigue matchup. That's fine. Totally fine. Still keep what my eight one protected behind the taunt too. He wants the breath of the infinite. Be my guest. Okay. Oh. Ooh. That was folly. I don't know about that, Chief. Oh, I just realized I don't have a dragon in hand. That's sad. It's okay to not get value from this, right? So I actually am paying that eight mana that leaves me two mana left over to do what? Also can I have a six six on the board, right? Wings of the sun come to my aid. Let's throw in an albatross, you know, just in case he wants to mass hysteria again. Plague of Death, that is completely fine. That would be a really good Plague of Death. That was like a Plague of me. Like, yeah, it was okay. Um, I think this matchup, Mirror Entity is still better, right? Spellbender will prevent my uh, Mountain Giant from dying, though. To like Shadow or Death. Mirror Entity is more. Mm, he's got some subpar units to res, though. But he might have a Katrina Moite. It could, eh, he's got like Bad Luck, Albatross, and Bone Wraith. There's some weird stuff. I play Spellbender. I can keep my Mountain Giant alive, and my Mountain Giant can just get decent trade on the virtue of being a giant ass mountain. I can punch people. It's fine, we got Spellbreaker for that. No, it's not counting spell, so. I don't know you do the Albatross. Your wish is my suggestion. Tyrion. Oh, Cabal Shadow Priest is great here. Change your mind. I assume we want to play a plague of Lamo, so. Perfect. 
Go ahead. Oh, mass hysteria. He's close to getting his quest hero power. Why isn't Dragon Caster Dragon, by the way? He's literally riding a dragon. My immersion, bro. My immersion. So not cool. Like, totally. Unity. Precision. Hmm, he might have the cow, but the cow heals at end of turn. He played both Plague of Undeath. That's why we have spell breaker, so we can break the spell. Your magic shall not save you. Two damage off lethal. I should play this while I still can. Plays another mass hysteria. I need to greetings. A way to do two damage face. Okay, that's one gallery, that's fine. Oh oh god, he's gonna get the heal again. And he's running Grand Archivist Alessania. That's right, we're gonna get him here though. G G G G no re. Ooh. Man, those albatrosses are really messing up my uh, Highlander cards. Ooh, Warlock. Most lucky Zoo Warlock is. I just don't think Handlock is remotely popular. I could coin out Dragoncaster on five to Flame Strike. Snip Snap is still relatively okay as well. Reno's not not bad either. We're gonna coin Dragoncaster into Flame Strike, or coin Reno. Supreme Archaeologist. What the heck is this? Draw twenty cards. Total originations. Draw a card. It costs zero. Huh. Very cool. I, I like the quest progress. It makes you feel like you're doing something, and it goes off every turn. Bring, bring. I'm gonna apply pressure. He's gonna do nothing but drop cards. Won't he fatigue himself? This quest seems kind of terrible. My hand is really bad though. They really shouldn't have put a dragon on a card called Dragon Caster. It's very confusing. The future is ours. Behold the tools of creation. Leaving up that one one make me regret life. I want to say no. Maybe. I want to say no. And what can you play? He can play that crazed whelpling. And even then, it's fine. I'll just play Rito. Yeah. See? It's all good. It's all good. He really wants zero mana cards, doesn't he? He's less than halfway there. This ability sucks. I'm sorry to say. We're going to have some fun. I have one, two, three, four, five. Five dragons to draw. He's halfway to his quest. And all he's done so far is draw some cards. Now the birth is a very good card though. Two mana to deal four damage. Four damage that can go face. Which is the most surprising thing. Two mana, four damage face is super smart. God damn, this is a this is a hard knock life right here. Well, this is good for you, right? You can spend a turn tapping, get your uh, ability, and maybe start fatiguing yourself. Yeah, tap. 
You love tapping, don't you? Whoa, no tapping? I'm up on your hopes and dreams already. Winds of the south come to my aid. You could like siphon soul it, but that's okay. You gotta siphon soul something. Twisting nether. I think the siphon soul would have sufficed. Fireball, because I want to smork his ass. Hell yeah, let's go. And the Sonic Brood Mother, seven more cards, and you get zero mana cards. He probably runs Alec and Shuffle, so he can draw all of his cards for free. That's big brain. Give a car a little, uh, a little ice. Put him on ice here. Caligos can give me fireball, which is great because I love killing people. Or pyroblast, which is even better because it just instantly kills them. Ah, there's the oh, you plot twist with Tome of Origination, so you instantly sh it complete your quest. Oh. And then you start playing two mana free cards. Wouldn't the Hakkar make things worse? Because you're drawing so much cards. I don't know. He's the master deck builder here. Okay, you have a zero mana card. Not playing it? What was the whole point of completing your ability? Hmm. He'll heal for six, which means he'll go to 15, which is unfortunately not <laughs> You gotta give the man credit for his creativity. Respect. Mm, I'm Warlock. Probably Zoo? I can't imagine what other kind of Warlocks Let the people games play. Begin. If it's Zoo, a Snip Snap's not terrible, but... Probably too slow to get me back in the game. I need like Doomsayer. Nice. Doomsayer, very good anti aggro. Very powerful. <laughs> Come on, Flame and Pum one, do it. Zoo Warlock, I think, runs so far in Leroy. Right, for the burst. They're so aggressive with their uh, demon summons. Hello? This is Zuwala. You have one mana. Your options are quite limited in what you can do. Tap. Alright. Hand lock. Can't play this next turn, but I could Doomsayer next turn to clear the board for a Mountain Giant. Why is everyone running Bad Luck Albatross against my deck? Your no, no, no Albatrossing. No, I'm not about that. I'm not about that life. Mm, Doom Giant. Hmm, that's annoying. Getting the first Giant on the board is such a huge advantage. If you get the second giant, you kind of just, you know, oh man, just co kind of copying his play. So many possibilities. Hello, Mr. Warlock, you have zero mana. Your options are not very high when you have zero mana. He won't trade, he's too smart for that. Aren't you, Ellie, those smarty pants? Who's my little sporty pants, huh? You are. Look, I want board advantage. You get past my reborn taunter to get that doomsayer. And my Siamet can have Divine Shield Wind Fury. 
Oh man, he's running a spell breaker. What a drag. And it's got more of a You're ruining my day right now. I don't like it. Yes, mm, Divine Shield. I think hitting this makes a lot of sense. It's the most healthy out there. Yes, if he has his own Siamet, ugh, that's so annoying. He's kind of matching us card for card. Spellbreaker, Spellbreaker. Mountain Giant, Mountain Giant. He can coin Abyssal Summoner, which would be a 9 9 here, but. By moon and spear. That's okay. Ooh, Dragon Caster, nice. Ready for a show. Hogga. Infinite hogging. Um, what can you do? Uh, he could play the gun shooter. What's his name? No, the guy with the guns. The guy with the guns. He goes like, pa 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 pa. Guys know him? So I can't ping that because if I ping it, it makes the gun shooter strong, right? Two, four, six. He can coil and then use gun shooter. I know he has a name, it's just kind of blanking right now. Yeah, I'm not gonna ping that. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna set his gun shooter up. Lord Godfrey, there you go. <laughs> gun shooter. Gun shooter, Lord Godfrey, potato potato. Fine with this Alex Rosalind. Still have an 8 8 on the board. <sighs> one twisting the other, one mountain giant, one twilight drake. Vessel summoner would be a 9 9, which is just annoying enough. Dark sky. Caligos and Maligos. First you get the Caligos, then you get the Maligos. Caligos, right? Who's, who's handsomer? Oh, they're both pretty damn good looking. The fate of the world hangs in the balance. Ooh, power creation. Hell yeah. Well. It's gotta be that. That is our battle cry minion, so... There was really no thinking needed. Kills one for free. Yeah, that might be a little tougher for him to kill. If Malagos gives me fireball, I can throw it so at his face. And I do like that. Should I use someone a 9 9 and then play Dark Skies? Unless his math was a little off. His math was a little off. He could have a 9 9. You face Jaraxxus. Damn, dude. Going Jaraxxus? Yeah, who's though? Coin your power. This is such a greedy list. Oh, little insane how greedy he is. Who's my greedy boy? You are. Okay, I can blizzard and ping. That's a two mana play. Ooh. What do I do with the remainder of my eight mana? Well, I can Tortolan into looking for possibly flame strike. You're in my hands now. Okay, didn't hit the flame strike. I'm kind of sad, not gonna lie. Hmm. Malagos could give me seven, uh, six damage with the fireball. Maybe I should look for Malagos first for potential lethal. How much does the fireball cost? One mana? Or is it four mana but it deals eight damage? <laughs> Shadow Flame won't do much. He could taunt, and that would do a lot. Oh, he's gonna taunt, isn't he? Shields up. Oh, that's some uh, beefy boys. What do we say to beefy boys, though? What can Malagos give us? I guess it really just. Oh wait, I'm not holding a dragon. The future is ours. The tools of creation. I see a vision in display. Uh, two mana AOE. 
Uh, or one mana card that gives me a card draw. The tools of creation. Or damage crossbow. Much better, but I'm not sure if it gets me there still. Wait, Zephyr should give me fireball, right? Because Zephyr gives me... Zephyr you never misses lethal, right? Oh, Zephyrus, you re Oh, wait, sack pack. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you, Zephyrus. That was the perfect card. Hey, lights out.